Hello, my friends, and welcome into our uh, next uh, Zoom about the social media and AI, how you can leverage your social media, how you can become more visible, and how you can generate leads uh, in what you need to do. I have a great presentation uh, ready for you. So I know you've asked, so I've listened, and this is especially for those of you that are looking to expand their social media presence. Uh, this is for intended for real estate agents of uh, Sotheby's network, particularly that is why this video I'm posting on uh, YouTube uh, for your further review. Uh, so please make sure you like, share, and subscribe to stay tuned and to have an updated news on everything real estate. So this is Yelena from Las Vegas, and I have a great presentation ready for you. And let me share my screen. Ta-da. All right. So as you know, this is Yelena Horton, Global Real Estate Advisor from Las Vegas Sotheby's. And today's topic, social media and AI tips. Uh, number one importance uh, is in our days for all real estate uh, agents is the social media promotion. Uh, social media promotion, it's a process of utilizing social platforms to increase visibility, reach and engagement. It's important that it's not just about visibility. It is at the end, it is engagement. At the end, we want to convert those followers. At the end, we want to convert those uh, listeners and people that follow us and people that look at our um, social media platform. We want to convert them into our clients. We want to make uh, them friends. We want to make sure they are engaging. Now, importance of comprehensive social media strategy that aligns with your business goal. I mean, we've heard it many times over and over, but this is true. And today you will have a social media strategy that you could utilize in your business. So number one uh, component that you need to do is identify your target audience. I know we've heard it all the times, but it is important. It is important to understand your target audience before implementing any promotional activities. Importance of creating biopersonal uh, identity profiles based on demographic interest pain points of your ideal customer. And this knowledge will enable you, enable you to create your promotion and lead generation effortlessly. And guess what? I've done all the legwork for you today. So let's take a look. So this is a bio profile demographic I've created based on uh, what I was interested. So I was interested in the, let's say, investor clients that are investors and clients that are buying second homes here in Las Vegas, Nevada, and that are uh, interested in luxury homes. So I will show you how I've created it after I am done with this segment. And so the bio profile demographic, because I've generated this bio profile using an AI, artificial intelligence. And that is what this presentation is about. I'm going to give you tips and tools and hacks that you could uh, do yourself. Uh, it's your convenience of your own home. You could utilize all these tools to create your own personal buyer profile, which I'm sure is going to be pretty much very similar because investors and luxury home buyers are going to have very similar profiles. So the age apparently for these uh, buyer profile demographics is 35 and 55. And you are going to need that data when you are posting your paid promotions, when you are targeting and creating further materials. So marital status, there are actually both categories, married or single, with obviously high level of income. Occupation is business owners, entrepreneurs, and investors. Now, by a profile pain points, what are these people afraid, right? What they don't want to deal with. And so um, they would like to identify profitable investment opportunities. They want to find luxury homes that meet the specific requirements, the requirements can be very specific, you know, it could be a question, it could be, you know, specific car garages, could be specific views and stuff like that. They want to navigate complexities of the real estate market, obviously with an expert, and most of all, they want smooth and efficient buying process. They don't want to waste time on too much communication, too much back and forth. They want things done, and they want to obviously maximize return on their investment whether it's a personal property or an investment, they also want to make sure that this is the right purchase. 
choosing the right social media platforms. Well, you know, there is a lot of uh, media platforms available uh, and each platform attracts different type of demographics, which means your buyers are using different type of platforms. So selecting platform based on your targeted audience preferences and behavior is super important. So it's important to maintain active presence on those selected platforms. And guess what? I did the legwork and created the right social media platforms for you so you can review it. So LinkedIn for professional networking connectors, great place for uh, reaching out to investors and staying updated on industry news. Instagram, showcasing luxury properties, lifestyle inspiration, connecting with influential individuals in the real estate industry. Facebook, joining real estate investment groups, accessing local market insights and engaging with communities on like-minded individuals. Twitter, following industry experts, sharing insights and trends and participate in real-time conversation about real estate and investments. And YouTube, watching property tours, investment tips and educational videos about the real estate strategies and market analysis. So these are your top social media platforms that are attracting this type of clientele. Now, next step is important. You have to create a crafting, engaging content. Very high quality, engaging content is super important on social media promotions. Your content strategy has to align with your audience preferences and interests. Again, this is, uh, I've created the content samples for you based on the a client interested in high-end luxury properties and investment properties. Uh, tips for creating compelling context, visual uh, elements, storytelling, and leveraging trending topics. I prepared it all for you. And look at that, engaging content, day one, motivational Monday. So this is an idea for your share an inspiring quote about real estate investing and tag it with motivational Monday hashtag and real, uh, real estate investing. Caption could be dreaming of building wealth through real estate. Take the first step toward financial success today and motivational Monday, a hashtag for you. Day two, tips and tricks Tuesday. Create a carousel post sharing the three practical tips for finding the perfect second home. Searching for your dream second home? Here are three tips to guide you in finding the ideal sanctuary. Which tip resonate with you the most? Share your thoughts below with the hashtags. Day three, Property Showcase Wednesday highlight a stunning investment property of luxury home through a visually appealing photo or video. Caption, introducing our property showcase. Feast your eyes on this magnificent house, property, ranch, condo. This gem combines elegance, luxury, and great investment potential and tag someone that you like. So, someone that you like number four finance inside thursday share a short video providing an insider tip on overview of financing options for real estate investment with a caption understanding financing options is key to successful real estate investing in this quick video we uncover a valuable tip that can make a big difference in your investment journey number five local market spotlight friday feature a snapshot of your local market by sharing interesting strategies trends or upcoming developments with this caption, this week's local market spotlight is on Las Vegas or whatever your location is. Check out these exciting market trends and opportunities that make it prime destination for real estate investment. Day six, success story Saturday. Share testimony of success story from a satisfied investor. Hear a story from a happy client that made our day. Today, we celebrate the success of so-and-so uh, who turned their real estate dreams into reality and swiped to read their journey. Now, day seven for the engagement contact suggestion would be um, on you encouraging your audience to ask questions uh, related to real estate, do Q&A, caption Q&A time, have a burning questions, drop it below or answer them. I'll answer them in the comments or I'll create a video for you. Now, I went further and created a second option for you. This one I created through BART and here I am going to introduce you to BART. So I am going to uh, share my screen. One second. Let me get bring out the BART because I was using BART to help me create this. 
Um, hold on a second, share screen. All right, so this is an app you just uh, download. You just go and download it on the Google. It's Bart Google. Uh, you just register with your usual ID and this is what your window is going to look like. So what I did was um, I asked Bart. Uh, it says new listing. Let me actually just go through the, 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 the. Yeah, actually right over here. So this is what I told Bart. I'm going to highlight it so you understand. You are an expert marketer, the best in the world. And I hired you to create seven social media posts for my real estate, uh, real estate Instagram. I am located in Las Vegas, Nevada. Have been in real estate for seven years and looking to attract investors, um, relocation clients from high states to uh, from high states from high income states, that's what I was trying to say, to our low income state and second home buyers. So you can change that need and the goal for yourself. This update and the board, it takes him what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay. Less than 10 seconds. He created seven social media posts that you can use to attract investors. Bam, bam, bam. I wanted to show you how it's done and so I've added those, share screen, ta-da. And this is option number two, created by Bart. And here is what the Bart says. A photo of a beautiful home with a caption that includes address, price, number of bedrooms, and bathrooms. Caption, this stunning home is now on the market, located in the heart of Las Vegas. This property is perfect for investors, relocation clients, or second home buyers, because this is what I told him my target audience was. What is, uh, with these spacious layout and stunning views, this home is sure to impress. Contact me for showing. Market update number two is the next option. Image, graph, or chart that shows the current real estate market. Caption, Las Vegas real estate market is hot, home prices are rising, and inventory is low. If you're thinking of buying and selling home, and again, you can tailor it to your city. All you do, you just say your city, and it's going to create it for you. Connect me today to learn more about the current market conditions. Next day, tips for buyers. Image, a photo of a happy couple with a caption that includes some tips for first-time home buyers. Caption, congratulations on your decision to buy a home. Here are a few tips to help you get started. Uh, get pre-approved for a mortgage before you start looking at homes. This will give you an idea of how much you can afford and will make. Again, this is BART created, this artificial intelligence. It all wrote it out for you. Do your research, learn about the different neighborhoods, be prepared to negotiate. Uh, the asking price is just a starting point. Don't, don't be afraid to make an offer that's slower. A higher real estate agent, a good real estate agent can help you find the perfect home and negotiate the best price. Next was, next day, tips for sellers. Image a photo of family moving to their new home with a caption that includes some tips for sellers. And again, the tips for sellers are provided here. Caption, congratulations on selling your home. Here are a few tips to help you get the best possible price. Get your home ready to sell, declutter, stage, make necessary repairs, price your home competitively. If your home is priced too high, we'll sit on the market for a long time, hire a real estate agent. Next one is testimonials, image, photo of a happy client, caption, I'm so glad I chose you to help me buy my new home. Uh, and they were so knowledgeable, helpful and stuff like that. Next one, behind the scenes look, image of a photo of you working with a client or showing a home with a caption that gives your followers a behind the scenes look at your work. Caption, here's a behind the scenes look at what it's like to be a real estate agent in Las Vegas. I'm always working hard. Again, created by Bart, just on this text that I gave him. Next one, fun fact, image photo of something interesting or unique about Las Vegas with a caption that includes a fun fact about the city. Caption, did you know that Las Vegas is the most visited city in the States? Again, created by Bart. I did not write it. Like I showed you in the previous screen, it was written by Bart. Now, if you want to uh, get more tips, for example, um, for example, we were looking on motivational, uh, motivational Monday, tips and trick Tuesday, carousel uh, for sharing three practical tips for finding the perfect second home. Let's do that. I'm going to stop sharing and I want to show you how I'm going to go back to Bart and I'm going to ask him, share screen. And I'm going to hear, it's in the bottom here. And I'm going to say, Create three tips for real estate 
estate clients on buying second home. And I want to put my location in Las Vegas. Las Vegas, Nevada. Okay, create um, three tips for social media, I should say. Three, three tips for Instagram, for, for my Instagram, and it understands if you have misspellings. For my Instagram, for real estate clients and buy a second home in Las Vegas, Nevada. Boom. You enter, let's see what board is going to create for us. So three tips for my Instagram buyers. Boom, done for you. Sure, here's three tips for your Instagram real estate clients on buying a second home in Las Vegas. Let's see what he says. Number one, consider your budget when buying a second home. It's important to consider your budget. What can you afford to spend on the monthly mortgage payment? What about property taxes and insurance? It is important to factor in the cost of maintenance and repairs. Great. Number two, think about your needs and wants. What do you want in a second home? Do you need a lot of space for family and friends? Do you want a home that's close to amenities? Or do you prefer a more secluded location? Once you know what you're looking for, you can start narrowing down your options. Number three, do your research before you start shopping for a second home. It's important to do your research. This includes learning about Las Vegas real estate and different neighborhoods available. It is also a good idea to talk to a real estate agent who can help you find your perfect needs. Bam. So Bart can help you create social media. This is the AI that can help you create social media posts that you can utilize in your daily life for all of the platforms. Now let's get back. I know we are on time. So let's get back to my quick presentation. So we just reviewed these um, tips. Option one, two, option two created by Bart. It gives you the visual, it gives you description. Now, next tip, optimizing profiles and bias. These are super important. That was in my previous video. So if you haven't seen it, make sure to review it. So you need to optimize your social media profiles and bias to establish credibility and attract followers. You have to look proper. Guidelines for optimizing profiles, including high quality images, keywords, rich descriptions, and relevant hashtags. Use consistent brand voice and visual identity across all platforms because this is you. Again, we talked about it more specifically in the previous videos, but right now I'm going to give you hashtag apps, today's topic, social media and AI. And these are the apps that you could use to generate your hashtags. Hashtags for likes. This app provides hashtag suggestions based on keywords you enter and offer insights into hashtag performance metrics. Right tag. Offers hashtag suggestions as you type and provide data on the popularity and engagement of each hashtag. Seek metrics hashtag generate. This tool allows you to generate a relevant hashtag based on keyword or phrase and provides data on hashtag usage and popularity. All hashtag offers a variety of hashtag generated tools, including options to generate related hashtags, top hashtags, and random hashtag based on a keyword. Instagram hashtag generator. This online tool generates hashtag suggestions based on keywords you input and provide information on popularity and difficulty of each hashtag. Download and use it because you do need relevant and popular hashtags. The reason people don't see your post, I see a lot of real estate agents don't use hashtags or use hashtags that are not uh, effective, are not relevant, and are not working. So I've created a list of hashtags using BART. I've asked Bart to create a hashtag for just listed property. And here is 10. I told him, say, hey, generate me 10 hashtags. So for just listed, just listed, new listings for sale, dream home, home for sale, real estate listing, property for sale, house hunting, listing agent, home, sweet home, your city location, and Sotheby's International Realty, basically your brand. Next, next one, hashtags for sale promo. You don't have a property to list. Again, real estate agent, realty life, top agent, real estate expert, property sales, home selling, real estate professional, realty marketing, hustle hard, agent life, your city location, and your brand. Now, next very important uh, point is leveraging influencer marketing. This is very good for your promotion, for your establishing credibility, and for lead generation. Partner with your influence uh, in the industry. Uh, this will help you to re, uh, tap in into their uh, type of clientele or it just helps you with your branding. 
And then tips for identifying and collaborating with influencers, such as conducting research and offering mutually beneficial partnership. For example, maybe you will provide, obviously you can cross promote each other, or for example, you will do an open house, for example, at their listing, you're promoting their listing, or you'll have someone's presence, and then maybe you're creating a cocktail hour for their people. So something that you can bring in uh, to these people so they are actually interested in cross promotion. Next step is engaging with your audience because you don't want to post and ghost, right? You want to post and engage. This is the rule. So important active uh, engagement with your audience. Uh, techniques for fostering interaction, respond to comments, message promptly, running contests and conducting polls. Ask your people, uh, the Instagram has all these polls. Yes, no, please make sure you use it. This is engaging people, staying them uh, engaged. Contests, you know, where you're doing prizes and say, hey, you know, the first 10 comments, you know, this week is going to have, uh, is going to be part of a raffle or a draw or something and announce your prize. Great tool. I use all this. Um, I love all these lotteries and drawing. I use it for all of my events. Uh, I always have these people get more engaged and say, hey, you know, at the end we are going to win, let's say, such and such prize. Paid advertising. It is important to have paid advertising if you want to use this option. Uh, so different options, uh, promoted posts, sponsored content, and targeted ads. For targeted ads, you need your uh, buyer's profile, which we've created earlier. Now, in having clear goals, defining target audience, we did monitoring campaign performance for optimal results. Uh, and we did that last time. We used, I showed you the SEMrush to show you how to actually track your uh, results. Uh, you in When you make a post, the SEMrush will give you a, a result of that post. Uh, clear goals, you have to understand. Number one, well, first you want to be visual, right? So you want to uh, reach out audience. The next goal could be branding and the next goal could be lead generation. They are different. So what you could use for that, for clear goals, Bart, let me show you how we do it. So I'm going to share screen with Bart. And I'm going to say here, create. Uh, create. So we are trying to create a goal. Um, for uh, creating, create a marketing campaign. Campaign for my real estate Instagram to attract new followers, right? So first you want a campaign for my real estate and then when your followers make it engaging, engaging and interesting. And let's see what Bart is going to do. And this, you can use Bart to create your goals and your strategies. And here we come again, run a contest or giveaway, great way to generate excitement, engage around your brand, host an Instagram live event. This is a great way to connect with your followers in real time, create educational content, share blog posts, infographics, uh, and videos, use hashtags, a great way to get your content seen by more people, promote your Instagram account on your website and other social media channels. Well, that was a great answer. Um, and back for the next of measuring six and uh, he has measuring success and iterating. So tracking and measuring your effectiveness on social media is super important because you need to know which post engage in what time. You want to post your post before the peak, before every day there is a peak. So you want to post before you peak. How do you know your peak? Let me show you. You have to go to your SEMrush account. I showed it to you last week. If you did not see it, uh, did I close my, oh no, let me pull it out. So hang on guys, I'm going to, oh, okay, so, share screen, da 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 da. No. Okay. Ah, uh, because it's okay. Hang on, guys. Hang on. I'm almost there. Okay, now I pulled out the window and I can share it now.
Okay, so I wanted to show you. So this is my SEMrush account. This is my calendar. So this is the post I have made. This is a post, let's say, coming out. So when I go here, this is a schedule, right? So I have a post coming out tomorrow. And I want to see that post. And so you see over here, when I do, oh, it doesn't show here. Okay, let me do, let me do a new post. For example, I'm gonna click on a plus to create a new post. And here's are my platforms and, okay, yeah, over here. See over here, it shows me that on Saturday when I have, uh, let's say I have this much people, 228 people looking at my post at 10. So on Saturday, the engagement starts late. Da -da -da -da, and it shows you the engagement throughout the day. Okay, so that's what you want to do. You want to create your first just before you engage it. Because if you create it too late, when already people looked at your account, it's too late. Okay, so that is why it's super important to use these tools. And next. Key performance indicators, engagement, reach, click-through rates, and lead conversion again through SEMrush platform. When you register and you just add your platforms in there, it will do that for you. And remember that social media is very has iterative nature and requires continuous optimization based on data insight. So yes, you're still going to need SEO promotions of your website and have that running on the background for you. Here is I use the SEMrush account that you could use for again, uh, keywords overview, generating and reviewing how much uh, each keyword, how popular it is and how difficult it is. So strategies for social media promotion, lead generation, audience targeting, we reviewed that today. We've created the bio profile using BART uh, and you can do that your, for your local market or you could use the templates that I've created today. Compelling content creation. We used BART to create your content. I gave you today two options and I explained to you how to use each and one of them, right? It gives you the visual and it gives you social media content. Platform selection, we reviewed them today. The platform, you could also uh, go in and ask BART and say, hey, you know, I have uh, what platforms do my buyers that are interested in home and such a such city as a second home investment, content and stuff like that, what platforms do they use? Profile optimization a review to our previous video, why uh, you know people can't find me. Uh, it's a very long one with practical tips on how to do that. Audience engagement through again uh, contest, polls, uh, you know, and all the tips we gave you today. Paid advertising, important part. Uh, if you want to participate, go ahead. Uh, if not, it's fine. And performance measure, because whatever you do, you have to be able to measure. Uh, and uh, these are my friends' strategies for social media promotion and lead generation using AI. And we used BART today on Google. And so we are at the end of our 30 minute segment. I was so happy uh, to be a part of this um, beautiful journey with you guys. Uh, helping you with your social media uh, engagement with your audience. And I am looking forward to seeing you at my uh, next uh, online tutorials and on my Zoom meetings. It was Yelena Horton, Las Vegas, Nevada, and I'm wishing everyone a fabulous day.